Hey YouTube, Dutchman Mods and Repairs here today. Working on 2011 Jeep Grand Cherokee Limited 4x4. And what we're dealing with is, if you see the picture I just had up, is of course the engine light came on. And I put my OBD to code reader on the old girl here. And pulling up a P0456 code, which is the EVAP system small leak code. And of course that could be not a million things, but it could be enough to keep you busy for a weekend if you're going to go hunt down everything. And the long and the short of it, it actually, in being a little proactive, I went and ordered a, got a little inexpensive smoke machine. I was going to go ahead and smoke test the, the EVAP system and <clears throat> see if it could find out where that leak was at. But before I did all that work, I said, you know what? I'm going to try something real simple just to see because you hear a lot about it. People running into it. And I said, why not? It'd be an easy way to, to check it out. And that is the old gas cap. And if you watch the whole video, you'll hear the whole story. The end result is that there was an issue with the gas cap. But I want to save you a few extra bucks because you might be able to do something even less expensive and simpler than replacing the gas cap to fix this problem and no it's not a little patch or anything like that so <laughs> we'll get beyond that so anyways let's open up the gas cap <clears throat> go back here take a look get the gas cap open up here now we're going to go ahead and open it up now what you've got on the gas cap is you've got this pretty hefty o-ring on the back side here and you've been around automotive work long enough you know that rubber stuff fails after a while cracks whatnot but that wasn't the problem with this no cracks it's not dry rotted or anything like that but gassets like this do get some kind of a you want to call it like a position memory the way they're in something and they get there long enough they kind of flatten out where they were around you know kind of formed up where they don't where they shouldn't be where they want to seal and so what i did is i'm going to show you the, the tool you can use any number of things to probably to get at it and i use this i've got this little this little hook tool right here and i basically flipped that o-ring around i just i basically scooped underneath worked it off and around flipped it upside down put it back down on there and reset the code and usually I could get that fault to come back that fault would come back within just a couple days okay but guess what that fixed my problem so real quick video test that out try that out before you go spend I don't know what those gas caps cost I'm gonna guess 10 bucks maybe I'm way off on either side of that but um yeah give that a shot flip that gasket around See if that takes care of your problem. That's what fixed my P0456 air code. Maybe it'll fix yours. Hope you have a good day. Hope this helps you out. I'll see you.